Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blues Battlegrounds in which we're exploring the Blood River in which two cannibals enter. The Blood River is a nation of cannibals that is alongside a polluted river. These are their leaders. We are a raider tribe, primarily led by two men. Binius, the butcher of Kansas, who guards the fertile lands of Kansas from the horrors of the east. And of course Derb, the strong, mighty, charismatic leader who's adapting to this changing world. Together, they can do anything. However, choices must be made on who will be prioritized. Binius requires men. Binius or Phineas? Or Derb requires resources. Derb? Huh. Hmm. Well, what resources do we have? We have... Well, actually, we we need that scrap immediately. And honestly, it's always good to get energy. Uh, we're going to go with the resources for this one. We already have some map ourselves. So, the polluted river. We The river we straddle has been polluted. Here's how it came to be. Followed up, of course, with... Stage is set. The conflict of brewing has put us in a unique position. Here's our plan. The Blood Flood, the polluting of the Northern River, or better known as the Blood Flood, was a result of the Bloor River raiders dumping hundreds of dead bodies into the river, whose corpses polluted the river and has caused widespread ecological damage or collapse in the region. A war between the Stargazers and Reaver movement has resulted from it. That's most certainly painted a target on our back. War, of course, is evident. And so we do have the Star Reavers, or Stargazers, appear led by Akihaba. She's the captain of industry. Also f fighting against Nebraska up here. Against the Reaver revival into Chrome Tack, which honestly looks really cool. To be honest, it looks really, really cool. So we'll see what happens with these guys. And we can only get 1.11 political power every single day. We can raid people, so let's go and demand tribute from everybody else. Is there anything else? We can clamp down autonomy. We can exploit the Blood River outskirts. We can get some more stability already, which I like. White Lines Drug Trade. Start a supply line. The White Lioners are the largest and most influenced drug traders in the wasteland. Their caravans can travel many miles, and many of our people are reliant on drugs to get by day to day. Perhaps one we can make a purchase? Um, uh, huh, that's interesting. And, do these guys have unique focus? It looks like they have a flag of Tennessee here. Uh, Binius. Oh, Binius is over here now. Oh, we're led by Derb. This is Derb. Oh, the White Lions rejected against us. Stargazers. We tribute as a Kansas chapter. Oh, wait. Rad Roach. Wait, we have a Rad Roach Republic. Look at that, the Roach King. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. Hive Mind of the Roach. 50% recruitable population. Nice. River Gods. War Legend. Oh, they don't have unique focus. That'd be super cool. Um, Stargazers. Oh, here are the White Lines. Led by Bossman. And Independence of the... They're guaranteed by us. Oh. God, that'd be cool to see them have unique focus. But we'll see what happens. The stage is set. And so the stage is set for our future. Through cannibalism and warfare, we'll stomp out our enemies from the region. But first, priority... Tag Team Duo, more organization than defense, which is not bad. Or, Red Blood Warrior, more division organization defense. Oh, let's be a tag team. Does it matter? Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. I'm not really sure, so... Red, Red Blood River, Tag Team Duo. Um, you know what, let's do a duo. Let's try that out. Uh, the Water War, the Coming Tides, more recruitable population and attack, but it's only for 175 days. <laughs> Selecting this focus will cause the water war to trigger. Be prepared. World tension increased by 5%. Let's do a new age. We'll go to well equipped army. We've conquered the polluted lands, plains of Nebraska. Now we must look onward. This is a new age for our raiders. And we have a tag team duel, which is pretty nice. Not bad. And what else do we have here? We got some divisions. Uh, become inspirational once we have enough command power, of course. And, you know, let's go ahead and just hire someone else here. Three political power, or yeah, three PP. Zach Wilson, he's skilled. I like that reckless. Uh, that's fine with me, whatever. Cool. And yeah, we need more political power, or command power, I should really say. Um, so who do we have here for advisors? Economic advisors Alfred Coburn, Toothpick, Fuel Boy, Sediment Builder. Nothing too. Well, pa actually, Patrick Babcock was pretty good for all that extra political power. Uh, Evander Tyler, Norton E. Will. Eh, that's not terrible. Not bad, not great, really, though. A power broker. More political power, but for plus 0.5 is not great. Petty gain conscription. It's not bad. Less supply consumption, better stability. Versus raider bans. Eh, if I can avoid going up the conscription level, I'll probably want to do that. Scientific devotion, air warfare, military theorists. We we'll probably want to go down with land auction, whatever we do end up choosing. Anything unique here? No, 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 no. Combat language is nice. Also, I think we only have two research slots. Yeah, that kind of sucks, I'll be honest. But that's alright. Things happen. Expanding the gang, not bad. Stubborn dude, I like this one. I like both actually quite a bit. Raider, ooh, five percent more. Oh, you just have to go with that one. Five percent more attack. Yeah, we gotta get more of that. But we're on Westside Economy. We're gonna go going down that way anyways. Under Zarbol's slave conscripts. Well, uh, 
Are we going to be using this entire game? Ah, uh, slightly more political power. It's not great, but whatever. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Blood and factories. We will begin our endeavors into war for an industry. Now, I do want to go to war, but our guys just are really not that great. We have more than enough army XP and divisions to do stuff here, so... Uh, at least go with that size. I don't know. As of the time of this recording, I I like getting some support companies in our guys. We have this. I really want to get sauce. Well, we'll wait maybe to get 18 combat with. And tech-wise, we are very... We are literally just raiders. Um, infantry, infantry, infantry. It's not bad for army and army. Principle. We're definitely not about purity. Special forces does go up for this one, too. Which is, I think, different than it used to be. Refined warfare. I mean, we're, we're literally just raiders. Trooper warfare. I mean, I hate wasteland tactics. I really don't like it, so... Um, reinforce rate... You get more recruitable population. Is that always been like that? Oh. <coughs> Never raiders. Because we're going to apply these tactics effectively. Automated warfare. Robots fight. Man with guns in their hands and discipline in their hearts. I'll be honest, man. Need the terror tactics, guerrilla warfare, mass assaults within the day. I, I, I've got to go down this side. I just do not like the right side. I don't like using militia. I mean, they're not. Don't get me wrong. They're not that bad, but I don't know. Just I don't like using them. But after this one, blood and factories, new technology, or political, I'll probably go with this one. We can get more political power anyways. So, 1.15 is still not too bad. Just so world goes down, goes down by quite a bit. Study our mistakes. Oh, drug trade intervention, approachment. Symbiosis. Ooh, that's, that's, that's nice. Good, 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 good. Let's grab some of this, too. White Lines is a faction leader. With By allying the White Lines, we can secure a southern border and reap the profits of being the protector. Join our faction, friends in need. Or, assuming drug control, or we can take control of the drug ourselves. A hundred day focuses. Cancel the guarantee of independence with the white lines, and claim the war goal for them. The end of the line, we get two cores, which I do like. Even though, white lines, drug alliance with drug trade withdrawals. Holy crap, that's bad. Making Psycho, I like that. Making Jet, I like that. Making Mentats, I love drugs. No more withdrawals. I like that a lot. So, you can do this short term stuff. Or you can do the long-term stuff over there, which is not too bad. Alright, so now we should have a little bit more command power, right? You should be inspirational. And you should get a promotion. At least for now. Since you're inspirational, anyway, just do that. If, you, if, we have, if we had enough command power, of course. For now, I do want to attack north quite quickly. But friends in need. Our new allies are quite vulnerable. A foolish nation would assume otherwise, but their drugs are viable. We must watch over them. Happy to help. Wait, are we supposed to do that? Uh... Oh, I remember the origins. Well, the Wetter War. I do want some more stuff here. Outskirt mobilization. Drug trade intervention. The White Lion's drug trade is vulnerable. As long as, as their most active customers, we need to make sure that we still get our fix. And we love getting our fix. Land auction, thank you. Yeah, it's probably best to do some... <coughs> excuse me. Land auction now. Cool, and we can close out of that one. Tax them. Well, let's get some army XP... Or, not army XP, but research slots so we can get some anti-tank. If you wonder about profits from the drug trade, please go ahead. Pass me a hit. Clamp down on autonomy. Basic hygiene. You know, give us more stability. We could really use it. I'm not going to lower the war support, though. That's pretty bad. Start of the supply line. Well, we're going to try to kill them anyway, so we'll see what happens with them. Having seven divisions, though, is pretty darn nice. I do have to say. The lab. Lab security. Um, they do have some de Ooh, that's, oh, they have demo teams. Interesting, interesting. How many caps do we actually have right now? 29, not much. Hey, we're considered a major power now. Let's do approachment. We also have a discussion with the White Lines before we make a decision that it could be a useful ally or a land right for conquest. And God knows I want a lot of conquest. <coughs> Excuse me. No more alliance, please and thank you. Widespread cannibalism. Hmm. Yummy. Yeah, getting more population is just, it's a must. But, welcome to army. We might go this way as well. Um, more output would be really nice. Who do we have here? Expanding the gang? Yeah, we'll probably do expanding the gang. But we'll see you first. Let's wait first. Hmm, it's not bad. Get someone here. Jeffrey, are you okay? I'll do Smooth Talker instead. I'll go Industrial Concern. Because what we lack in technology, we can make up with industry, probably. Uh, actually, you're building this yourself. That's pretty good. Nice. Rot Purgers. Very good. Oh, we have the Murtaugh flag or something. There goes the Matrons. Um, assuming direct control. If you want to read about this, please go ahead. I mean, this is nice and all, but 
I, I just want to take them out, so. Assuming direct control. The white lines are a significant threat to our southern border. Anyone can just steamroll through. Let's dip our toes into the drug making business. Might as well, right? Hopefully we don't do too poorly, because if we do, well, I'm going to have to go off screen and do a few funky things, probably. Even though I would like us to get some more workshops, arms workshops. How many divisions do they have? Because they, 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 they don't have enough divisions. Well, yeah, they might, actually. We'll see. We do have eight divisions ourselves. Mm, let's wait to do that one. Let's just come over here. Nice. Keep building them up. Build, build, build. When in doubt, build them up. Blood and factories. Our raider squad is outgrowing the polluted river. We require uh, more. The land is uh, no more fertile than it was before. Now we have many mouths to feed. We need to plan our future war goals now, either through the factory or through blood. A small decision, but required one. Right, so that's the case. We don't need that many divisions. Let's cut down by one more. That's not bad. Focus on these stuff. Scavenging. Odyssey on Bright Soul. Call for a raid. We, when it's like we get 300 manpower, we lose a ton of stability, though. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm not sure that's worth it. I'll be honest. I'm not sure that's really worth it at all. Mm. We're going to go outside our battalions, probably, because that's really most beneficial for us. Uh, which one do we want? Slaving dude? I don't want her organization, to be honest, man. Most of sense. Well, let's grab some more population. We can always use that, right? And we need time to get that stuff. Oh, industrial support. Let me get that one. Not bad. Could be better, though. How much does this cost? 10 caps, that's not bad. That's really not too bad at all. Uh, 9 divisions, that's good. And they are 18 combo with, so not bad. And now we need minus 465. Well, that's not great. So after this one, end of the line, it's probably good to get this stuff cored as fast as possible. So, white drugs reliance. Minus 8% recoupable population, huh? Well, I don't think we see it over there. Alright, well, whatever. We do lose attack and defense, but plans for conquest... That'd be good to do, but I do do the water war. I won't get the coming tab, but these focuses are just so long. So long, man. Just so long. I guess we'll do end of the line. <laughs> end of the line, drug makers. Your business is under new management. We could really use that extra up. Just just spaces here. Raiders of the sky. Well, we can't even make that, so... I'm not sure what we're supposed to do about that for now. Cams have been, of course, been legalized, which is great for us. And we're out of money. This is not good. Caps, yeah. Well, so much for that. Oh well. Economic advisors, factory output. We could probably honestly use that right now. So, my gosh, a hundred day focus is so unbelievably long. We do have ten divisions though. Even though this division has up to fifteen, maybe it's kind of insane for fifteen battalions. What if we can just make an encirclement here somewhere? I think we do very well. And merely two more weeks. The Stargate is pushing. Oh, uh oh, oh. Well, that's not good for them. We also have the bees. Uh, Binius, how are you doing? How many divisions do you have? Six? That's not bad, actually. They're out of equipment themselves, but. So, yeah, that's not bad. Alright, assume direct control and end of the line. Are you seriously attacking? Can you actually win there? It would be great if you could actually win. I'd love to attack here instead, but I don't really trust our guys too much, so... Yeah. If you can win there, that'd be great. <coughs> Excuse me. Can you guys actually go there? No. Alright. Got everyone else from the, every, everything else. There you go, good. You guys go right here and do that too. Just take whatever you can off of them. Here, do that. These guys will die. I think we'll do okay here. We'll do definitely do okay. Maybe not great, but definitely do okay. Promise of loot. It's not bad. I do prefer this one though. Let's get some more war sport. Because we could really use it. Hey, that division's gonna die? God, we hope so. Keep it up. We're getting a lot of army XP, for better or for worse. Nice. Yeah. 
Oh, we took the lab. Great, they're gone. Beautiful, and we're getting the end of the line. Making Psycho, that's only a 20 day focus. To deal with withdrawals, we need to create our own Psycho. I love it. I should do everything for the bees. Because if not, I'm just going to go ahead and just start manually just flying on them. No? Alright then, I guess it's time to just find these guys. I'd love to see stuff for the for these guys, but oh my goodness, that takes so long. Wow. Alright, that costs quite a bit, but that's right. Whatever. Making psycho, my friends. How about you and me? We be making some jet. The deal with the withdrawals, we need to create our own jet. Because I want to get down here as fast as possible. Um, actually, maybe not. Actually. Wait. So we remove making jet, psycho mentats, and drug trade withdrawals. Hmm. So this gives us minus 8%. This gives us 3%, plus 3%, it's 9%. So basically, you, you, yeah, you might as well just go down this way as well. Yeah. Even though you're going to lose, what's it? More war sport and division attack. Yeah, you lose 5% more attack. Honestly, is that, something even, is that even really worth doing? Honestly? And you get 5% you get division attack and defense and organization, but you get 2% here. So it's not really worth it. You might as well get all this stuff when you create your own jet. Um... And just kind of keep it there. Yeah, I guess you do lose it. Uh, yeah, maybe not. It's only minus 4% attack here. You get 1% more attack. With this one, you get 2% more. So, uh, it kind of is balanced out a little bit more. Yeah, I kind of see that now. But still. But still. How about making Mentats? We'll do a deal with the draws we created on Mentats. What type of template is that? The bees? Honey beasts? <coughs> Can we beat honey beasts? Also, after this one, we're going to definitely go for saws. It's just It's so good for defense. It's, it's not even fun. It's just so good for defense, man. I would like to get, though, and we definitely, definitely need some. Uh, get some good to know. Uh, living standards. Eh, that's not bad. Eh, that one too. I don't mind hurrying our research speed. Uh, realistically, just getting more... Just divisions. Manpower. Stuff like that would be really good. So, uh, And what I really was trying to mean. Trade note. First People's Junction or New Sterling, those are or Lone Star. Those are so far away. I am and Robin One, nice. Vault of Eden, look at that. Um, honestly, we'll probably come down here. Probably check these guys out. Probably eventually Trailblazers, just so we can get a. Oh, the Chain Quarters looking pretty good. The first Quarter, yeah, they don't have unique folks too, which is disappointing, but whatever. After this one, uh, no more withdrawals. With our supplies, the drugs renewed. Our withdrawals are over, which, eh, yeah, we must well do it. Why not? Then we're going to do what? Right, study your mistakes. Rejection of industry. Oh, look. We're going to start, we're going to start learning. Nice. I'll get some sauce. We have more than enough army speed for it, so I'm not, I don't feel too bad about clicking on that one. Uh, new frontiers, huh? <coughs> oh, we get another research slot. Oh, that'd be very beneficial, actually. Missouri Outlook. Brother back in action. Free land for the taking. All right. War of Terror. As long as it's not the War on Terror, right? War of Movement. Odyssey on the Rise. Roach King Proposal. Colonizing the Land. Get another research slot, too. Well, let's do the Water War, just so this way we can get some uh, political power. Tensions are brewing between our neighbors to our north and us. We need a plan in case of conflict. Which 70 to focus, man. What is this? Base game, Hoi 4? Oh, boy. That is painful. That is quite painful. But at least we got these guys cored. And also, when we run out of things to build, just build a lot of uh, infrastructure. And screw you, you can build some airports too, because if you really want them. We have 13 divisions. That is really not that bad at all. We got plenty of equipment, though. Wow. Enter Del Sol. How many more days do we have to wait for these guys? <coughs> oh, we're not even halfway there. God dang it. That sucks. Why is it so bad? Hurt the research speed some more, that's fine. The Water War! Excuse me. I'm just a little tired of the time of this recording, so. No more withdrawals. We got more attack, more defense, and a little more population. We're kind of okay with that. Rally the Raiders. It's only for 175 days, which isn't great. I'd rather get the Arms Workshop. 
Um, after that, let's see. New technology, industry. Um, welcome to Kansas. Take Kansas. Get some cores. Monthly population compliance speed growth goes up. Future ambitions, huh? Free land for the taking. As much as I want political power, let's do new technology. So, if you wonder about this, or we were cannibals once before, and as cannibals that we all shall remain, or new technology. Focusing on technology is our key to our dominance. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say so. Adapting is pretty important in, in life, so. Uh, up next, we're probably going to grab... That's a little bit ahead of time. Let's grab some warrior training, just so we can start getting some of this stuff done and accomplished. Just because uh, I want to get some more defense and breakthrough, because that'd be great. But now, since we have that made... Let's grab one of you guys. There you go. Try your best with those. We, I definitely want some saws in the divisions, so we'll see. Yeah, and then take out the bees, take out the trailblazers, Cherokee Nation. That'll be good. Industry support's gone, unfortunately. But we're building up our industry quite well. <coughs> we only have four, huh? Well, that's not going to fly here. There you go. Now we're going to need like 600 or 400 some. Not bad. Um, Honestly, get more attack. More, max planning would be really nice, but just get some more attack. 5% It's not much, but we'll take it. And some new tech. And boom, there you go. Followed up with Plan for Conquest. With Nebraska under our domain, the path for conquest lies clear to Kansas. It will be ours. Yeah, I don't think there's really anyone who could really stop us from doing that, but you never know. Um, that wouldn't really help us out too much. I'm sorry, I just cannot stand to go the other way. I need to try some way. I don't have not tried out the right side of the path yet. And I guess I could in this campaign, but I don't know. It just... It looks nice, but... I don't want to have an army of just militia. Let me know in the comments below. Do you guys use army of militia and enforcers? Have you tried the Wasteland Tactics? Is it worth using? Let me know in the comments below, because I'm just... As you can tell, I'm not very... I'm very apprehensive to use it. Get more breakthrough. Locals get more soft attack and hard attack. Um, daily command power goes up. So let me know if you guys actually use that. Because I, as you can tell, don't. So Simulation drive. We'll see about that. Produce more stuff. Get some more stability. Yeah, stability is pretty important to get. After new tech, plan for conquest because we want to go to war. Study our mistakes. Uh, blood stained aftermath, huh? Ah, we have to get down here. The plan's growth speed goes down, but... We do get quite a bit more target resistance, so plan for conquest. Nice. And then the coming tide. With a war for survival on the horizon, we need to focus on producing weaponry for our raiders to use. Well, we only get one, which to be honest, isn't great, but okay. Sure, why not? And we have no occupied. Oh, oh, maybe we do. Here, waste some pacification. Yeah, that's not too bad. <coughs> And these guys, I mean, come on. Okay, we're about ready to go with the war, which is great. It would help if I gave him orders. Get some planning in, guys. And they're immediately... Oh, oh, hold on. Hold the phone. Wait, why did they go to war with us? Were they guaranteed by these people? No, well, that sucks. I'll be right back. All right, everyone. So right now, I've gone ahead and just kind of hung out around here. We've lost about 100 guys versus 800. And they also declared war on the Rad Roach Republic, so we'll see what happens. They're spending their time with them, but we're rallying the Raiders right now. We must rally the nation for war. We will fight to the bitter end. So we'll see what happens. Bleeding Kansas. Cause water war to trigger? A town is coming to strike. The enemy's on our borders. We must put them down swiftly. I'm not sure if I really want to do that one immediately. I might just say we won't do any focuses right now and just like grab a bunch of political power, which I am totally okay with. Broken Tribute? Oh man, that kind of sucks. Whatever, I don't really care. I just want to make sure that, uh, oh, that we hold on. And honestly, uh, do they have power armor? Uh, I can't really tell. Also, they do have an intel advantage. And I do want to make sure that we do okay. I don't mind if the Rad Roaches die as long as we can get them too. I think that'd be great. <clears throat> so we're just going to suck, or they're going to suck on our divisions for now. We're going to do the best possible job we can. And Settlement Builder, Civilian Factory stuff, you know what? We'll grab that one because we can. <coughs> Uh, how much manpower do, do these guys have? Holy! 
bad words. That's a lot of manpower. These guys are probably gonna die first, and depending on depending on who attacks and who doesn't, because this is kind of it's kind of nuts. Honestly, can we actually just do the war like this? Here, you guys get out. Get a new commander. You know what? We'll probably just do the war anyways. Thirteen divisions is pretty good. Ambrose Van Dorn, uh, since we're here anyways. So, um, bleeding Kansas. The time has come to strike. The enemies on our borders. We must put them down swiftly. We'll see. Because these guys should be able to hold out pretty darn well here. It's only three divisions, but still. And as long as they have no other way to get into our territory. I'm mighty fine about it. Mighty fine and mighty happy. But I did grab a cup of coffee if I haven't said so already. Uh, grab some inspirational because you can. And we'll see what happens. How many divisions? They oh, they don't have... Oh, 17 divisions. A lot of manpower. But we've got quite a bit of manpower too as well. Um, I did want to go to War of the Bees, but obviously that war justification kind of went bye-bye. These guys are level 4. Wow, that is nice to see. Let's just go rooted. Thank you. No, we'll be okay. Let them attack us. We'll be probably more than fine. But we're becoming a desert fox anyway, so. Very nice. Very, very nice. Hope you guys are having a pretty good day. I'm doing okay myself. Yeah, as long as we're defending, we should do okay. We really should. We'll make it one division. Make it two for now. Make it two. We've got some anti-tank rifles, which is very awesome. Uh, let's see. Industry-wise, let's grab that one. It's fine with us. And what else? They keep attacking. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Because I don't think it's, they're going to let up anytime soon. Uh, since we're here, you might as well grab this one. War Industrial. It's Bleeding Kansas. Follow it up with. Um, our warriors are fighting for survival. And, and, and adrenaline is running high. Much like an animal, they'll fight with every last bit of energy they possess. As long as they don't kill us too hard. Or harshly. Oh, we got some divisions. They're only 14 combo with, which is not great, but okay. We'll take the patrolmen back. Yeah, that's not bad. We get some more organization and stuff. It's not bad. Awaken the dragon. Economic mobilization. Everyone for the war machine. Ooh. Consumer goods 10%. Um, is that really worth it? I don't know. Look at Awaken the dragon next, though. The blood market is home to thousands of raiders and cannibal. It's time they pull their weight. Not a bad idea. Alright, so if you all come into here, could you guys actually win? Because if you can go here to there, that'd be great. And now we're on a two-front war. Oh, there goes the Maxon chapter. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, but seriously. We had no, like, warning that these guys were going to attack, which really sucks. Really, really, really sucks. And my goodness, I hope we can do well here. There you go. Uh, only one of pop guns, please. Oh, the Legion overruns the Mojave. I do want to let you know that we are on historical, so... Seeing that is kind of weird, but whatever. Tax him. Because you can. Um, promise of loot. Yeah, I would like to get some more uh, war support, so. Awaken the dragon. Followed up with. Outskirt mobilization. Hey, stonks, nice. The outskirts are our ace in our hand. Or ace in the hole. By taking them off the Missouri border, we can focus more on the war at hand. Loose some population. Organization loss goes down. Division organization. Oh, I want a good war to someone else, apparently, too. Not bad. Yeah, you should still do relatively okay here. Oh, it's going to be such a slaughter trying to get all the way over there. You guys are advancing. That's actually pretty nice. 87, you guys should be able to push into here. It might help if we sacrifice this guy. Maybe. Lone Road. Help dig up some of their entrenchment, which is good, 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 good. And we had our war goal against the bees again for August 2nd, so... We'll definitely see what happens. Man, this sucks. They're just going to continually cycle more soldiers in and in and in and in and in, which is god awful. 300 some. Yeah, they're not. We're not going to be able to beat them. Hold on. That's so dumb. Yeah, let, let, let them attack us. That's good mobilization. Yeah, come on in, you pieces of garbage. And you're going to do this against them too. Ah, well, not, not unless they stop attacking. So. Well, I guess we're going to learn here. He's already level 2. That's actually pretty nice. The other fox, not bad. You guys are hanging out too. You guys actually win there? You actually might be able to. And they won't be able to beat us on defense, hopefully. That's why I wanted those saws. Those LMGs. Alright, so you're done. Honestly, why don't you just go to war with you guys? 30 day focus. We'll probably do pretty darn well. We have to go and need some more fire teams, but that's alright. We actually have some demo equipment already. Might as well do that, right? Might as well. And clay working is pretty good too. 
Wedge formations. Nice, nice, nice. And outskirt mobilization. Recall Binius. Binius, a butcher, Kansas, is the highest ranking general in the Blood River. It's time our enemies learn to kneel. Nice. Oh, you can attack as much as you want. You ain't gonna win, son. You ain't gonna win. Van Dorn. Ambrose Van Dorn is doing pretty darn well. Let's go and become Mr. Stranger. He's learning, a, he's very, learning very quickly. I love, love, love. He's level 3. He's almost level 4. Jesus. How about you? Zach Wilson? Um, Negotiator. I like Savage Leader a lot. Junk Rounds. Uh, melee Hacker. More attack is not bad. You know what? We do want. To, we do need some more attack, so we'll get some more attack. Defense? Not really worried about. You guys? Uh, let these guys kill these guys off first. And then we'll try to take them out. But do we have what are called Binius? Ununited in Warfare. Yeah. With Binius back and the outskirts mobilized, the time has come for us to truly unite our industries. Four more factories. That's actually really good. I like that a lot. Oh, are they actually trying to beat us here? Eh, they might. You never know. But now they're taking a lot of losses. Kansas chapter is almost gone, which is great to see. Any other divisions we make? Uh, definitely have to come over here first. We do be struggling over here just a wee bit. Now you're level 4, which is great. Kenny Desert Fox, you might as well become one. Nice. 2, 2, 3, 3. His, his stats are very good. <coughs> Come on, guys. Please kill these guys off. And, uh, uncaged animal territory. Nice. Hopefully these guys run out of stuff. They're out of anti-tank. They have a little bit of demo. They have a little bit of infantry equipment left, but hopefully not for long. Yeah, definitely go 3, 3 here. Um... I don't really want to load this anymore. Kind of have to, though. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Hurry up, please. Just kill yourselves on the line. Make us learn as much as possible. Level 4, level 4, level 3. Oh, it's so nice to see. Keep making. Keep making. And what else are we going to do here? Oh, the Kansas chapter's in. You know what? I'll just give it to the Rad Roaches. They deserve most of it, so. Whoa! 500? Why is it 500? Wichita? I'm trying to give it to the right faction. I'm not even trying to take it for myself. <laughs> Go figure. Um, 1100 as well. Why is it so expensive to take all this stuff? Um, there you go. You take that first. I apologize for uh, the amount of clicking I'm doing right now, but unfortunately, as you can see, it is what it is. So we haven't win anything, but we're going to immediately go to war with them. And hopefully we can hold there. United Warfare. Economic mobilization. We're not an industrial powerhouse by any means in the region. However, production weaponry is hardly keeping up. We must speed up this process. We should probably did hurt this over here a little bit more. Consumer goods. A promise of loot. Let's not do that one right now. Call for a raid. Nah. Um, yeah, well. So, war bonds. Oh, we're not making any money. That kind of sucks. Promise of loot. I would love that, but... Mm. Here, hurt research speed. Clay working. Not bad. Grab some plant cultivation. Anyone else have upgrades yet? No? Okay. Yeah, you guys can come on in. Oh. Yay. Yeah, you better be learning a lot, Benjamin Morgan. Becoming Desert Fox, which is nice. No. And Ambrose, you're level 5 already. Jesus. That is so nice. Just so good. Yeah, they're killing themselves off, which is so great. 700 versus 2,000, 2,600. It's going to take us some time to get through that, but that's okay. Total victory? Well, we're working on that. So, yeah. Um, we'll probably read this one too. Our armies have marched into Nebraska. The enemy's been completely dismantled. Now we must decide what to do with the lamb. But, with this one going to get finished, I'm going to go back up. As much as I love that one, I don't want to really go to Raider Bands. I don't keep as much... Eh, well... It's not too bad. 11%. It's really 8%. That's not terrible. We'll see. We'll, maybe I won't lower it. Maybe we'll keep the way it is right now. But... Outside Auxiliaries. It does lower War Support, does it? Ooh. Balance for Conquest. Octaz Elusive. Um, we'll go with non-slaving dude, slaving dude, hmm. Oh, actually pushing us down here. So I'm going to have to redo this just a little bit off screen, which I figured I'd do anyways. But I'm going to end it here. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we all have at least beaten the Reaver movement, most likely. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.